So what, what are the things that are produced during fermentation? Well, microbes that ferment certain foods will take the basic substrates like the carbohydrates, the proteins, and the fats, and they'll produce things like peptides, like dipolonic acid, for example, is a wonderful peptide that can reduce inflammation and, and help circulation and help blood pressure and all kinds of things. Uh, they produce urolithins, which help your mitochondria repair themselves and, and uh, kick off autophagy and mitophagy. So removing damaged cells and cellular debris, they produce short chain fatty acids like butyrate, right? So they produce all of these and an array of vitamins and minerals and all of these things. So fermented foods are basically nutrient dense packed foods that can be very beneficial, assuming that you don't, you're not sensitive to that particular type of ferment, right? Because some ferments will have high levels of histamine in it, which is a by natural byproduct of the fermentation. So some people with histamine intolerance, for example, may consume that and they may be reactive to that, right?